It would help if we could decide here and now on your name. My name? Yes, ma'am. Your regnal name. Uh, that is the name you will take as queen. Let's not overcomplicate matters unnecessarily. My name is Elizabeth. And long live Queen Elizabeth. Don't you get sick of it all? And lonely. I do. Which is why it's so important to have the right person by your side. You understand the titles, they're not the job. She is the job. Loving her, protecting her, she is the essence of your duty. We have a new sovereign, young, and a woman. I'll escort her down from there. No, sir, if you don't mind, the crown takes precedence. You don't think I would have preferred to grow up out of the spotlight, away from the scrutiny and the visibility? Be firm, just lay down the law. I know he's Winston Churchill and all that, but remember who you are. You're Nobody. the Queen of England. This new Elizabethan age comes at a time when mankind stands on the edge of catastrophe. You my wife or my queen? I am both, and a strong man will be able to kneel to both. I will not kneel before my wife. But your wife is not asking you to. But my queen commands me. Yes. I beg you make an exception for me. No. What kind of marriage is this? What kind of family? I need to speak to my sister. No! I am aware that I'm surrounded by people who feel that they could do the job better. Strong people with powerful characters. But for better or worse, the crown has landed on my head. I have seen three great monarchies brought down through their failure to separate personal indulgences from duty. You must not allow yourself to make similar mistakes. The crown must win. Must always win. has landed on my head. Never let them see the real Elizabeth. What kind of marriage is this?